Hi everyone, my name's Simon and I'm a GP in South Liverpool. We wanted to get a message out from practices in Liverpool to patients to try and give you some help and support and advice to get through this coronavirus crisis. Obviously the government has told us all now that we must stay at home to stay safe, to try and protect the NHS so that we can save lives during the crisis. And in Liverpool we really, really, really support that and it's vitally important that unless you absolutely have to get out to attend medical appointments or go and get food, it's really, really important that you take the government and the NHS's advice and stay home. Only by the NHS being protected will we be able to look after enough people during this virus pandemic. Now because of this, the way the general practice works in Liverpool has changed. I'm sitting here today working from my spare bedroom to try and protect patients and try and do as much as we can without having to come face to face. So what can you do if you have symptoms? So if you develop symptoms that might be coronavirus, and you'll know by now, but just to repeat it, that's a high temperature or a new persistent cough. These symptoms are really, really common at most times of the year, but at the minute, it's very likely that they could be the symptoms of coronavirus. So if you do that, we need you to seek help in a very specific way. Please, please, please don't go anywhere. Don't go to a doctor's surgery, don't go to a walk-in centre, and absolutely don't go to hospital. The first thing that you should do is go on the NHS 111 website, where there's all the advice there about how to treat your symptoms, and more importantly, how you and those who live with you should self-isolate to help reduce the spread of the virus. Now, if you can't use the internet, that's not a problem because you can also ring NHS 111. The number is in the name. But you should make sure that you only do that if you've not got internet access because, as you can imagine, they're really, really, really busy. What about those people who've got health needs that aren't related to coronavirus? You know, the world goes on despite the fact that we're fighting this virus. The good news is your general practice is open for business. We are there and we are here to help you. We're just not able for you to book an appointment to see us face to face for obvious reasons. So therefore, we would ask you to contact your GP in a different way. So I'm currently at home taking calls, speaking to patients and making sure that everybody that needs to be seen is seen in a safe and appropriate way. So the first port of call should be to ring your general practice for things other than coronavirus. If you're unwell for another reason, if you've got a query about your medication. We've got ample medication supplies in the UK as long as we keep using them the normal way. So please don't ask your doctor for stuff that you don't need or extra stock. The pharmacies have got enough to see us through this crisis and that won't be a problem. There's also online services. Many of you will be registered and have an app and I know that I text my patients, I video consult with my patients. And for those of you who have not tried that yet, it's really very easy to do, no matter how savvy you are with technology or no matter what device you normally use. So contact your general practice or go on your GP's website and they'll be able to give you advice and support about logging on so that you can order prescriptions and you can do electronic consultations with your doctor. By us all working together and, and using the NHS sensibly, then we'll get through this crisis. But please remember, the NHS is still here for you. We are still open for business in general practice in Liverpool. Thank you.